Hi everybody, it's Deb from D&D Art Gallery. Today I have a 12 by 16 inch canvas. I'm going to do a swipe. And let's get started with my colors. My base coat is the Rust-Oleum Metallic Accents Champagne. And then to that I added just a little, not even a dime size of the um, Amsterdam Van Dyke Brown. It just richened that up a little bit, darkened it up just a little bit. As you can see, I have it all over my canvas, uh, on the sides and the corners. My next color is Arteza Iridescent Fancy Black. My next color is a combination of the Arteza Iridescent colors. There's Electric Plum Purple and Royal Purple. I did a little combination of that, those two purple colors. My next color is um, Reeves Copper. And my last, um, my next color is Color Art Primary Element, the pigments, and it's the Stargazer. Very pretty blue color. And my swipe color is going to be Folk Art Pearl White. And I'm going to lay the paints down a little bit different here today. I'm going to be using these little cards to swipe with also. So let's get started with our colors. I think I'll start with the copper. And I'm gonna like stagger the colors instead of going just straight across, hopefully. Just stagger them at different levels. Just see how this works out today. And my pouring medium, I forgot to mention that, two parts flow troll to one part paint, squirt of, a squirt of GAC 800, and about, um, about a teaspoon of the um, Liquitex gloss medium and varnish. No silicone was added today to these paints. Okay. My next color is, I'm going to do the two purples, a combination of the two purples. And my next color is the Stargazer Blue. That's the, the color art, um, the elements. This is totally experimental for me. I, I've never seen this done before. And I just thought I'd give it a try. And my last color is going to be that black. First time using this color.
and I did torch my base color before I got the camera rolling today. And I think I will put another row of the copper before I get started with the swiping. Okay, that's a pretty heavy layer of that copper there, but we'll go with it. Okay, so let's just start our first swipe here. Oh, I need my swipe color, don't I? Okay, so I'm going to take the white, and I am going to put it in the middle here of all the colors. What's nice about this is I can always go back and add more, more colors here and there. If it doesn't turn out. Okay. Now let's see what we can do here. With the swipe. Oops, wanted to start at the top for some reason there and that's not the way it works. As you can see, I'm not swiping all the way down to the bottom either. Okay, let's turn it around so I can get to this side a little easier. And I did forget to swipe that way on that one, but I will go back and get that. And I forgot to go the other way on this one too. We will get to them.
And I will need more swipe color here. Okay. And I'm going to put a little bit more swipe color right here. And I'll need some more right here. Okay. Okay, I'm just gonna do a little bit of tipping now. Let these paints run a little bit. And tip this way. Okay, and I think that I, I, what I really love in here is the copper. And I think I'm going to be adding a little bit more copper here and there and swiping. And I also may use a tool to, to bring out some of those black lines when I'm done with the copper. I think the copper is, is, being, a, is being a star here, so I want to add a little bit more. Here and there. And maybe just a little bit more white. Okay, let's see what we get with that. Just really having fun with this, this painting today. I like how it's added that copper there. Very pretty. Let's see what we get over here. And I do like how that black is being dragged down also. Just gonna do another swipe here. And now I'm going to take my skewer and the black just to see if I can add a little bit of black here and there.
just trying to run the black where there are lines already. Just to enhance it a little bit. Very pretty. I think what I'm going to do too is just add a little bit of black in certain areas. If I can get just a very small, small line of the black here. Maybe some more of the copper. And a little bit more of that white. And give that a little swipe, see what we get. I really like that. Just go one more time lightly over here. Yeah, I really like that. Just trying to see the plain areas here. I think I will try and swipe a little bit of black there. A little bit of white. See what I can do here. Okay, I really like that. Let's do a little tip now. I'm pretty happy with that. Maybe a few more lines. And I'm going to torch it. I'm going to get my other torch out. That one is a little low. And I will clean up the sides off camera. I'm very happy with this painting. It's got a lot going on for it. And I'm glad I did add the black lines in there. Just going to continue that black line down a little bit. better. Okay, I'm going to get you down for a close-up. Again, this is a 12 by 16 inch canvas that I did a swipe with a lot of the metallics. And I will have to show you this after it's dried, see how it, how it does dry. And this is the upper left-hand corner. 
Love how all the colors played together on this painting. Very pretty. And this is the lower left-hand corner. And I'll take you up the middle here. It's one of my favorite spots in here. It's very colorful. It's got a lot going on for it. Right in there. And here is the upper right-hand corner. Pretty in here too. This is the lower right-hand corner. So let me know what you think. Give me a thumbs up if you like this video. Make sure you share it. And subscribe if you haven't. Ring that bell. Choose all. You'll Then you'll know the next time that I do post a new video. Until next time, take care, everybody. Bye for now.